Hey, how are you guys doing, man? This is boy David. Today we are back with another Texas Chainsaw video. Now, I want to say, man, we tried to reach 2K this year. We might not do it this year in time, but we're definitely going to do it next year. Um, and just subscribe up if you're new to the channel. I do more than horror. Horror. horror shit. Horror. I can't say horror. Right. I don't know why. I do more than horror content. Why can I say it right, bro? Horror. I do. <laughs> I do more than horror content, man. So subscribe up if you're new. Uh, we do a lot of different videos on this channel, but we got to get into this because this is very important, very important. Now I want y'all to listen because a lot of people have like this, like false idea or like false sense of how they think online matchmaking is going to work. Even myself included, I didn't know how the hell matchmaking was going to work, but we're going to be talking about it because they did go over this on Twitter like a couple of weeks ago. So they posted an exit from uh, one of the maps. I think this is a slaughterhouse. Yeah, it's an exit for the slaughterhouse map with any the, you know, the electric fence and everything. I think somebody pointed that out in the comments. Um, but this guy says, would you be able to choose? Or would you be able to, yeah, would you be able to choose if you can play as a killer or survivor or is it random? They said family and victims will have separate matchmaking cues. This goes for solo play or partying up with friends. Now, I'm not going to lie to y'all. It's no secret. When this game comes out, I'm not partying up with random. Y'all not going to sabotage me, especially when when you got to work as a team, but at the same time, be so independent in this game. No, you're not. It's in the slaughter. I mean, at the at the slaughterhouse or I'm sorry, um, which map was it? I'm trying to think. I'll get back to it later. But like, I'm not going to be getting sabotaged by randoms. I would suggest everybody to load up into games with friends. If you guys uh, are new to the channel, if you want to subscribe, I'm going to be doing games with subscribers. I'm not playing this with randoms. I don't think I'll be able to. I, I don't think like when I say randoms, I mean, like I will on my own time. I won't be able to load into a game with like literal randoms, people I don't know. I want to be able to survive. I want to be able to win. I want to help my teammates. This is like a bro. You're going to have so much teamwork. But at the same time, it's so like you're the lone wolf at the same time. I want to help y'all escape. I'm, I'm focusing on myself, but I'm looking out for y'all. I don't want people to sabotage me. So I'm going to be honest. This is more so like the dead by daylight kind of, you know, um, or, I mean, Friday was kind of different because you only got one killer. But I think when it came to like dead by daylight, um, you literally were in a whole different queue if you wanted to be the killer. And, you know, of course, there's like hundreds of people trying to load in to be the killer. So you're going into different games and everything. But the survivors and the victims, they were all in one queue. So it, I don't know. Are you going to be able to? I'll, I'll ask him. But I think pretty much like if I want to be Leatherface, but you want to be Sunny or somebody, I don't think we'll be able to get into the same game. I think we're going to have to be if you guys want to be on my team, we're going to have to be the killers or survivors. There's no mixing and matching um but i kind of want to make sure that's the case but i mean it pretty much says it there they're gonna have different matchmaking cues i didn't know it would be that way i thought it would just be i don't know why i thought it would be this way but i thought it would be just like one lobby and you just kind of choose what you want to be but they're gonna have two separate matchmaking cues and that's not a bad way to run it at all i just didn't think it would be that way i don't know why though but honestly, my my suggestion would be to not load into this with randoms unless you just don't care. But I want to have fun. And it's kind of weird because we're not going to have communication because they don't have proximity chat. Hopefully it's something they can add later on, because I think it will be realistic to have proximity chat. And if we're crossing paths or something like that, we can just at least have that brief moment of communication. But you're going to be having this. You're going to be having teamwork involved in these games while also being super, super individual, like our independent. I'm sorry, but man, I think that's a concern. I think that's why everybody's asking because they're like, I don't know, bro. I'm excited, though, man. This more so plays into what I talked about as far as me recommending that y'all get like a, a friend group to load into these games, because it says right here. While other faces are requ is required to be part of every match, any other combination of family members can be played alongside him. Leatherface will be in every game. Every game. I don't know. I mean, there's two ways they can go about it. You could manually pick your your uh, the killer you want to be or the family member you want to be, and it'll load you into a lobby. 
to where other people wanted to play as the other members or they load you into a lobby and it's for first come first serve hopefully it's not a first come first serve kind of thing you can pick who you want to be and then they can load you into the lobby accordingly but i i don't know i don't know um that's kind of what i talked about though because the last thing you want is for everybody to be hog and leatherface honestly i'm gonna try to get good with their with the victims that's just me um i don't really want to play as a family right away but the cook is somebody like i'm keeping my eyes on like i really want to play as them but i really hope it's not a situation to where everybody's hogging leatherface hopefully they let you pick who you want to be and then they throw you into a lobby accordingly i don't know though i don't know man but i hope you guys enjoyed this video hopefully i explained this um in a way to where it does make sense i'm gonna ask to double check hopefully they respond on twitter but i'm gonna see y'all next time